Hey guys, you're watching Boondocking with Dennis. I am just off of the 35 bypass, Brockport, Texas. Just north of where the bypass crosses 188. So this says 345 bypass 35, Buttram construction, Buttram construction, Employee delivery only, no entrance. Employee delivery only, no entrance. I don't know if that means no trespassing or if we're allowed to go back here. But apparently they're setting up for a big development. I was just curious what was back here. I don't see any no trespassing signs. And if I'm someplace I'm not supposed to be, I apologize. I was just curious what type of homes are being built. Now I noticed this road because there is a, what I consider a tiny house for sale. And I'm going to do a separate video on that. Take a look for that. Create a new folder for tiny houses houses and sheds and things like that that people convert into houses I do see some palm trees back there I don't know what kind so I wonder if this is going to be a country club type area or maybe this has been here forever and they just raised palm trees here pretty neat it's a very nice road it's a nice big road Circle P construction, maybe? There's a nice pond. Wow, they have they do have some houses here set up. I think this is going to be really nice. Get in early, kids. Get it while you can. Get it while it's hot. <laughs> yeah, there's two homes set up over there. They got chairs outside. Here's some dirt. You all like dirt? I like dirt. There's another pond over here. I bet you that'll be nice when it's all landscaped and all that kind of good stuff. Here's more palm trees. This is going to be high end, guys. Well, you know what, let's, uh, I guess I could have looked on the map and see the overview of where these streets go, but that would require being prepared. So is this street a circle or just going one way? Let's find out. I think it ends right down here. Oh, wow, look, a water tower. That is really cool. They got a little Texas in there. I can't tell. And parts of that look brand new and parts of it look like it was repurposed. Which I actually like. Yeah, the, the paved part of the road ends up here. So we'll be turning around. It does bend though. What's right around that bend, guys? That could be where all the good, good houses are. I know Rockport needs houses. Look at that. They got some live oaks. So I guess that's a future road, huh? I guess these are all future roads. I think I see a spot big enough to turn around up here. But it might just all circle around. I think I see a... Is that a porta potty way up there? <laughs> Woohoo! Porta potty. Yeah, let's turn around up here. I don't know if AAA is going to come get me. It kind of looks like the road ends right there, but I'm not really sure. That is not a porta potty. Darn. You know, I like to keep track of where all the porta potties are get turned around here 
I'm already turned around. Let me actually turn the truck around and we're going to have the wind blowing in so maybe I'll put up the window for a minute. And while we backtrack, let me show you the dirt. What the hell? There's all the trees they had to dig up to make the roads. Hopefully they'll do some replanting, right? Maybe plant new trees for the trees they took down. So we all have clean air to breathe. Let the trees do their thing. We're back to the main road here. Oh, it's a little bumpy, guys. A little bumpy. I think I'm ready. You guys ready? Welcome to the Plastic Surgery Addicts Group. I see a lot of new faces here today. Damn. <laughs> we heard that one. <laughs> One more. The waitress said to me, careful, that plate is hot. I said, it's okay, so am I. <laughs> hmm. And then the waitress filed a lawsuit against me <laughs> for sexual harassment. I'm losing my house. Anyway. All right, so this joke thing is funny, but they are not dad jokes. <laughs> they had a couple dad jokes in there. I like it. It's handy whenever I um, do these little impromptu starts and I don't have uh, one of your guys jokes that you have been emailing me and putting in the comments. Put the jokes in the comments guys because then I can just do a screen capture. Because sometimes I, if you email me a joke, I put it to the saved section of my email and that is no man's land nothing good ever happens with an email when it goes into my save section so i wonder if this development has a name yet or if they're just in the opening process of setting up the roads man i wonder how many palm trees they put in here Usually I ask what type of palm trees they are. My question today would be, how many palm trees did they put in here? Well, this looks like an established community up here in the road ends. So let's, uh, let's turn around and get out of here. And I uh, hope we don't get stuck going off-road here. It is a little bit soft. It's okay. We got momentum. We let momentum be our friend. We'll come back in a year and see, uh, check the progress that they've made. And I, I noticed that, uh, I'll show you the tiny house on the way out, but I've got some different angles of it for a video. I've been looking at that tiny house for the last few weeks and I'm always going somewhere or Someone's waiting on me. And today I purposely came just to look at the tiny house. And when I looked at the tiny house, I saw these new roads. So I wonder if the tiny house and this construction project are tied in. But there's the two established houses and maybe they are the uh, sample homes but pretty neat it's a good location right at 30 35 um, the bypass you know the highway 35 I guess the other one would be business 35 and uh, 188 you're in Rockport not too far from all the jobs that are opening up in Gregory, Portland, Taft, even Corpus. You're probably, I don't know, what do you think guys, 15 minutes from North Beach, 20 minutes from North Beach, providing there's not some type of traffic jam on the causeway, which was way too common when I lived in that area. 
I just wanted to take you on a little ride. It's another paved road right down there, but it's probably more of the same thing, huh? We'll save that for when we come back again. Looks like they're still working on sewage and things like that. So there you are in the early stages of a development. Pretty neat. I'd like to know what it's called, if any locals know what it's called. There's the tiny house I was looking at, and I did a one-minute video about that. Hey, guys. Thanks for riding along today. Thanks for watching.